Hello everybody, what is up? Steel over here, and today I'm posting a video guys for the new Modern Warfare 3 map, Black Box. It's a pretty good map, but I'll talk about that in a little bit. But I got an AC-130 on it for this game, and you know, it's not that good. It's not like an Osprey gun or like my last gameplay. But I'm just posting this for you guys to see the map and stuff like that. And uh, what is that guy doing right there? What the heck? But uh, okay, anyway, sorry if I sound a little congested guys. I had a cold this past week. Not like a terrible disease, cold, flu type thing, but you know. My nose is a little congested, a little clanged up, if you could tell. But, uh, yeah, back to this map. So, I, I do like this map. I actually think it's a lot better than the last three maps released in the Elite Content Drop or whatever. But, uh, you know, you can buy the entire map pack on, I think, March 20th for all Xbox users. Sorry, all you PS3 users. You guys gotta wait. I'm kinda sorry for that. But, uh, yeah. I think all you PS3 users can buy this map pack on April 16th. I'm pretty sure that's the date I read it somewhere. Uh, you can just, like, Google it, make sure I'm right. But, you know, I'm always right, guys. Just just remember that, okay? But for this gameplay right now, it did take me a while to get some kills right here. Uh, there was a little space, but, you know, as you guys watching, you could just sort of watch the scenery. And uh, when, I, when I recorded this in theater, it kind of was weird when I was recording. Like, uh, every few seconds, it would, like, flip the screen or whatever i don't even can't even describe it. but uh yeah here you can see a nice little overview of the map there's that nice little plane this map is basically afghan and terminal that got a little frisky with each other and then they had this baby and then it had a gene mutation so it grew a little bit of grass but uh that's probably the most accurate possible overview slash summary i could give you but uh, yeah seriously i do like this map a lot it's probably the best map actually in my opinion i, I do really like it and I, you know, you, I re if you don't have this map, you could buy the uh, the map pack. But you know, if you're just gonna get the other map packs, you could just get Elite, because uh, getting Elite is just ten dollars cheaper if you end up getting all the map packs. Because Elite costs sixty dollars, and then each map pack is fifteen dollars. Or no, Elite costs fifty dollars, and then each map pack is fifteen dollars. So that you save ten dollars basically. That's what I'm trying to say. But you know, I do like this map, and right here they're all walking up the stairs. So I set a little trap. You know, I do know I'm close to my C-130. And they shot down my tech helicopter because they're gypsies. But you know, it's a good map. It's got some nice scenery like all the maps in the map pack. And it's got that cool little plane in the middle. I don't think I, sh I was in it during this game. But it's really cool. It's got some nice fighting points. I definitely recommend any assault rifle or even snipers. Especially snipers work pretty good on this map. Uh, in the, If you're ever in that plane though, uh, some machine guns do work pretty well. But really, anywhere else, they don't. So uh, definitely assault rifles work pretty good. So here I have my AC-130 saved up from the previous round. And I always like to wait a few seconds because you guys do know there's that 5 second spawn protection. Protecting against all kill streaks and explosives and stuff like that. But I do get my AC-130 call it in. And I started out with a shkabang getting 1, 2, triple kills. But I, I basically fell after that because I only got like 2 or 3 more kills after that. I don't know what happened. But at least I'm in my AC-130 raining health from above shooting big bombs at them making them afraid of me but uh, also up here you could see just an overview of the map you could see that big crash plane which i think is actually air force one from the campaign and also there's a lot of openness a lot of condos as well just huts and uh, little houses like that a lot of them have very good sniping points with uh, an overview of the map so uh this ac-130 is coming to an end right here uh there's really nothing much else to talk about this map black box but i also wanted to talk about the two new spec ops missions uh, one's called Negotiator, and the other is called Black Ice. I actually played one of them. Uh, I played Black Ice. That was pretty funny. I'm actually going to probably give you guys two live games of it. And by live, I mean, like, I'm probably going to record what I'm playing as I'm commentating over it at the exact same time. Because normally what I do is I get some good gameplay, and then I commentate over it, like, right now, what I'm doing. But uh, in this, as I'm playing the game, I'll be doing my commentary, so it's uh, it's pr it's gonna be pretty fun. I've never really done that before. And the first Spec Ops mission I played, Black Ice, was actually pretty fun. I'm pretty excited to play the second one. It's called Negotiator. And uh, after it ended, I did get an achievement, which is pretty nice to get. Does a uh, PS3 get achievements? I'm not really sure for that one. I know Xbox does, but yeah, in this game, I just start crapping on them. I uh, pick up another Predator missile right here. I was going for another AC-130. But I didn't really see that they were all shooting at me, and as I pulled it out, I tried putting it away. But, uh, you know, I did die right here, so this video is coming to an end, sadly. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys, and those of you who actually do have this map, tell me in the comments below if you do like it or not. I know I like it, and I want to know if you guys like it. But, uh, that's basically it, guys, and bye.